2018, a misstep of justice people will never forget. Mr. Reeves um, has destroyed lives. He has damaged families' fabric. This man, Colin Reeves, has been walking free since this night when police say he was driving drunk, eventually crashing into this car that was making a left turn on Alma School Road. The collision killed Audrey Dillard, Giselle Torres, and their dog on impact. There's a one-year uh, statute of limitations on DUIs, and he was not charged with that either. That was due to a gross mis a gross oversight of our office. Fast forward to Tuesday. Colin is now facing three endangerment charges. I mean, it's a really good feeling. So, you know, it can never bring back Giselle. It can never bring back Audrey. But it also um, it lets people know that this type of behavior will not be acceptable. Back to this night. The county attorney's office dropped the manslaughter charge against Colin, too, because they couldn't prove he caused the crash. When they entered the intersection, they would have had the same light sequence. So if he had a red light, she would have had a red light. If it was yellow, she would have had a yellow. Um, but Arizona statute says that those who are turning left must yield to oncoming traffic. Now the victim's families want to change that law. We need to tackle the left turn law. We need to tackle that in a way that says that if you are intoxicated, you're driving, you take a life, you are automatically at fault. That family friend has taken that idea to local lawmakers. The family wants to call it the AJ law for Audrey and Giselle. Back to you.